The Countess of Wessex cut the ribbon to mark the opening of the Royal Windsor Flower Show as it marked the Queen's Platinum Jubilee with garden displays, floral arrangements and a celebration cake. Sophie was joined by the Royal Windsor Rose and Horticultural Society, RWRHS, Honorary President Alan Titchmarsh at the York Club in Windsor Great Park on Saturday, as the organisation also celebrated its 130th anniversary. Sophie was pictured alongside the gardener and broadcaster as she cut into a large three-tier cake adorned with fresh flowers and the royal coat of arms which was baked in joint celebration of the RWRHS milestone and the Queen's Platinum Jubilee. Watching her inaugurating the flower show, royal fans couldn't stop praising the Countess of Wessex. Twitter user John Turland tweeted, Not gonna lie. I've always liked her. She's dignified and does more than people know. Deserves more credit than she gets. Another user, Bavan, tweeted, Edward, Sophie and their children seem like a beautiful family. It's been great to see some of the work they've been doing to support the Queen. Royalist and proud. A third Twitter user, Kerry Clark, tweeted, I really like this lady, she seems really down to earth and looks genuinely happy. A fourth Twitter user, Englishman Wales, tweeted, The hard-working and unobtrusive Wessex. The Californians could learn a lesson or two from them. The Countess also gave out prizes to the winners of the children's competition to create a miniature garden fit for a queen, flower arrangement, with the best entry to be presented to the queen to sit on her breakfast table. Members of the public who attended the event donned a mix of plastic, paper and flower crowns in celebration of the special Jubilee Year show. The public, along with the Countess, had the opportunity to visit the Queen's Platinum Jubilee Garden designed by award-winning designer Alan Williams of Landform Consultants, whose work has previously featured at the Chelsea Flower Show. The RWRHS charity was established by the Queen's great-great-grandmother Queen Victoria in 1892, and has been supported by six generations of British monarchs over the decades. Sophie and Edward recently returned from a royal trip to Gibraltar, where they met locals and watched the Queen's birthday parade. In a message dedicated to Gibraltar, the Queen said she was delighted the Earl and Countess would be visiting on her behalf.